guys just landed in Cairo uh, as we're coming out of the plane. We're going to go towards the immigration and passport control. I was just told as Americans you can arrive here uh, and you can get the visa on arrival. But in order to get the visa on arrival, you have to go to the bank. You have plenty of banks over here. They're open 24 hours, I guess. And you get the visa from there. I think it costs $25. Let's find out. And then you take the visa to the passport control. You can also change the money from there as well. So let's let's find out ourselves. Okay. As I said earlier, it's a pretty big airport, but it doesn't look this busy right now. You can see it. Uh, we just arrived. It's a uh, quarter after 12, and first we need to get the visa, and then we go to the passport control. Very nice building. Pretty long walk guys. That was our plane over there. And that's another building. Yeah. Heading towards the baggage claim. Guys, the story is this, that uh, once you arrive at the Cairo International Airport, what you need to do is that you have to go to a bank and you present them your passport and give them $25. They give you a sticker ticket and uh, you bring the ticket to the visa uh, passport control center. And the gentleman would put that uh, cigar on your passport, stamp it and that's it. You come down and as you can see, down and you come over here and that's your arrival in baggage center. Uh, there's a lot of airport services people over there they would offer you car services and hotel services it's up to you if you want to take it or not uh, but Uber does work here and you can also take a taxi. So I'm going to try Uber. I've never done that before and this is my first time in Cairo so I'll share the experience with you. People say it's pretty safe. Uh, let's find out. Alright guys, so I'm waiting in the baggage claim area, uh, still waiting for my luggage, but just to give you guys an update, so when you're here, you come down from the password control, if you turn right, uh, there is an orange telephone company booth is over here, and they offer you SIMs and telephone packages, and uh, you can get it from there, or if you make a left turn, on the, all the way down there, I see the sign for Ati Salat, which is uh, a telephone company from UAE. Uh, you can go there and get that uh, SIM card from there as well. Uh, we're still here. We gotta collect, collect our luggage, and then we have to go to the customs. So there's another process. Uh, it's not like the European countries that uh, you pick up your luggage and then you just uh, walk through uh, green and red. I hope that's the case over here as well, but like I said, this is my first time. So we got to find out, but I'm still waiting for my luggage. The flight was delayed two hours, but the service really good. Uh, so that compensated for the delay, but uh, still waiting for my luggage. Uh, it's uh, 12.43 in the morning and uh, about 40 minute ride from here to downtown uh, Cairo. So by the time I get there, it'll be like two o'clock in the morning. 